We're training for the season. We're training for the season every day. Think about your reps. Think about that drill. Think about your technique. Get out of thinking about, I'm tired. My privilege to introduce to you this morning, Auburn University head coach, Brian Harson. I'm very fortunate to work with fantastic people and to be around fantastic kids. And I am excited to be the head football coach at Auburn. And, and I'm looking forward to this season. What I saw from our players and our coaches was leadership opportunities for them to step up, which is exactly what they did. And you got a chance to see guys uh, provide leadership. You got a chance to see coaches provide leadership. And what it did, it was united our football team. kick-ass summer. Since January to where we are right now, you guys remember in January we had 757 issues. We're right now at like 0.003%. Okay? Give yourselves a hand for that. Right? <laughs> Next to nothing. Next to nothing. We can get better. Right now officially in training camp, the journey begins. So take advantage of it. The 2022 college football season is underway, and the Auburn Tigers gather under the leadership of second-year head coach Brian Harson. Super proud of you guys, all right, for where we are right now. And I mean that. Yeah, I've been doing this for a while, playing football, all right? I am more excited about this team because of what you guys have been through and the things you've done to get to this moment right here. And now it all begins. This is where it all begins, right here. I don't know how it's all gonna turn out. I just know this team's got something special and that every single day, I just wanna be around that. A grueling off season on and off the field and a national consensus declaring the Tigers as underdogs could challenge any team. But Auburn is no stranger to outperforming expectations. Everybody is important to helping us win a championship and winning a national championship. That is facts. That is absolute facts. And when you learn that, everything will make sense. And when you don't understand that, nothing makes sense. This is not a selfish man's game. It is not, it is a team sport. You have 10 other guys on the field to help you do your job. Stopping the run, running the ball, whatever it is. You can't do it alone. You're not good enough. And that's not what this game was built around. For one man, to go out there and do it all by himself. That is not what this game is built on. It's built on team. That's the principle behind this entire game, is team. A college football program is more than the 11 players on the field. Months of preparation and countless behind the scenes contributors are critical pieces of getting the team to Saturday. So we're usually here around 5.30 in the morning um, making sure that every, all the laundry is out, everything's ready to go, looking at the daily schedule. We have 15 students that are on scholarship with us. They're responsible for setting up the field, making sure that they're following scripts, things like that, making sure the coaches are prepared for the daily practice. Um, but no equipment room in the country can do it without their student manager. So um, if you had to know how this is all done, it's, it's those 15 students. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Last year was new for everybody. Like, I didn't know Coach Harson, I didn't know his staff all that well. I was coming out of open heart surgery, and I just got jumped in. So I didn't really know where we were going and how we were gonna get there. Completely different year. 
Everybody knows the plan, everybody knows the script, everybody's ready to roll, everybody's looking forward to a high energy season. And if you look at our schedule, it's pretty daunting, but it's really fun to you know take a look at where that's going. And I think the players are on the same page, the coaches, staff, our student managers, our equipment staff, we're all pushing in the same direction. Um, and that just brings the energy, so I think that's really cool. Always training for something. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Hit. Hit. Take punt. Go. Hit. Go. Get it. 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 Set. Go. Set. Go. Eyes up. Eyes up. Go. Stand tight. Go. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Run. 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 Reach. Hit. Take punt. Good. I guess the last guy. Here we go. Here we go. Obviously, it's just the roughest time of preseason. You're about to get things rolling. Season about to roll around the corner. So, uh, you know, it's just a long, lengthy days, and uh, the days you have to endure to um, be successful. Summertime, running the decks to now we're in the pads. It's 100 degrees outside and we're grinding together. It really shows who loves football, who loves ball, and who wants to be here. Oh. Hey, take care of that football, man. You wouldn't be here if it wasn't for the ball. Go. You need to know what the offense and the defense is doing and what they're thinking and what you're trying to accomplish. You want to come out on offense and start a drive and you want to get a first down. Go get that first first down. You want to keep them from getting that first first down. Okay, the more we can do that and understand these situations, the better off we're going to be. Has everybody got it? Yeah. 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 Gotta have more energy. Come out here ready to go. All eyes are on you. How the guys responded after those first few days being really, really rough. Um, all us in the heat. Uh, it's been really good, really promising. We've just been working, putting the days in, getting better every day. So I mean, it's been going really well. It's just fun. Every chance I get out, I get to go out there and compete. I love it. Uh, there's a lot of work to be done. Obviously, we're still still in the early stages of of camp, but. Some good things have happened uh, so far. I've uh, seen a lot of different guys progress. I mean, progress in the team, progress in the defense, so could be more excited. Great energy today. Hey, team on three. One, two, three. Team. Let's go. Full game, full game, full game. Hey, it's just another day of football, baby. That's all it is. Football, we get to do this. I'm going to tell you right now, this is the best you're going to feel all year long. Isn't that right? Yes, sir. That's right. This is the best you're going to feel all year long. This is why you play. Grit, toughness, mental toughness, physical toughness. That's what you're going through right now. It is training. It's a grind. It's meant to be. We're training for the season. We're training for the season every day. Think about your reps. Think about that drill. Think about your technique. Get out of thinking about, I'm tired. We know it. We already know that. That's assumed. Your body's going to be stretched to its limits. We know that. OK, now how do I work through that and also still play at the highest level I can through practice and ultimately the game? That's what you're thinking. That's your challenge. Your challenge isn't, I got to get myself. No, you're going to be tired. You're going to be fatigued. But how do I still play through that and execute my assignments. Okay, whatever that is, you got to find it, that second win, whatever you want to call it, your teammate. But I can tell you this, man, the worst thing you can do is get in your own head about how you're feeling. That's the worst thing you can do. 
Okay? You gotta start saying to yourself, I'm good. I'm fine. I'm gonna be okay. I got energy. I got this. I'm focused. I'm ready. I'm gonna hammer this next rep right here. I'm gonna get it just right. I wanna be in. Give me the rep. You're dog ass tired. Give me the rep. Okay? Start thinking differently. And your body will respond. I promise you, your bodies are trained. Start thinking differently. It works, man. This right here, this right here leads everything. It works. You can do anything. You can do it. You can go do this practice again. I promise you. I promise you, you can do it. Okay, so that's your challenge. Your challenge is in your own brains, in your own mind, all right? What are those affirmations you're gonna start saying to yourself? I've got this, I'm strong. I'm gonna get through this practice to the best of my ability and everything I do. Whatever it is, man, start saying it, start believing it, all of a sudden it's gonna happen. You won't be worried about anything other than what you're doing and we're playing, we're operating, and we're getting ourselves ready to go out there and execute, which is what we wanna do. Everybody got it? Yes, sir. Okay. D Hall, you got us. Let's go, D. Team on me, team on three. One, two, three, team. Let's go, team. Let's go, team. Let's go, team. Next time on the journey, Auburn football. And then tailback, you get you get a little depth as you're coming out here. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of sets off for looks. Try to get them to chase you. We've got a lot of new kids come in and, and really help us. Uh, they're gonna help us this year and really excited to kind of see them grow in this system together. I do like to lighten the mood and uh, just bring that energy, that enthusiasm each and every day. Attack them, good! Oh, oh no, that's a broken tackle! That's a broken tackle! You train for these moments right here. We need to see the best from everybody. What we need is everybody's best so we can evaluate where we are.